Okay, this is totally, we're not going to use Joe Rogan alone. Hell no. Um, but, when they're take, when he when he's saying something to millions of viewers, he's got influence over people. Okay, all you got to do is say something wild and, and, and look for the reaction. Okay, now there's plenty of evidence. You don't just go and lie. And, you know, when it comes to this stuff, he's not lying about people getting caught lighting fires or... Uh, leftists lighting fires FBI wants to say that's untrue FBI wants to say tell us to stop spreading rumors like that because it is a it's it's fueling a dangerous surge of vigilantism oh yeah you don't want us to unite and take our own country back oh and guess who else is in on it local law enforcement in Oregon yeah Oh yeah, sellouts. Look, and, and please believe, it isn't the police. It'd be at the top. Okay, at the top. Not the guys that matter. No. Um, not the guys doing their jobs, and or, or not doing their jobs because they're being told to stand down. Absolutely being told to stand down. So, here's another look. I want to show you something. Okay, oh yeah, about the leftists. It's absolutely true. I've been keeping a, um, tabs on Jeffrey Accord and in the Pierce County Jail. Hold on. I don't know why. I just don't know why it does that every time. But I think it goes to this, this little bullshit screen every now and then. And then... You have to, this is weird, uh, keep going in. And it's like, oh God, I've never had to do this. Okay. Oh God. Sorry about this. Anyway, he's in there. He should be in there. Um,. He's, he's got a court date coming up, and we'll just go prove it. And we'll just, Jeffrey Accord, we'll just go prove it. Okay, arson two, burglary two, concurrent, 150000 bail. He only needs $15,000, basically, to get out of jail. Okay, Jeffrey Accord. Hmm, interesting. Oh, let's just, let's just make sure everybody knows uh, uh, when his uh, court dates are. And uh, you can show up if you'd like. Matter of fact, if he gets released, you can wait for him outside. Um, jury trial, November 4th. I, I thought that was a little interesting. Um, seeming seems that it's the uh, uh, day after election day. <laughs> anyway, um, well, let's just check him out. Jeffrey Accord. Fire. You fucking little bitch. High bail. Yeah, right. It's a $15,000 bond. Jeff Accord. Oh, oh, no. Leftists aren't burning shit. No, he only made a Facebook video. And he, and he and they only backtracked his, uh, uh, pro, um, all of his, yep. Supposed to appear to show Black Lives Matter support. Yeah, he's just a dumb shit kid. He's not. He's nothing. And he and he just wanted to get away with something. And and uh, and and you know what I'm saying? This he just wanted to be a piece of shit. He's a dirt bag, and he's one of those guys that need to fucking be followed and watched. And getting caught with burglary. Imagine what he hasn't been caught with. That's the fucking point. That's the points I make with those little bitch ass motherfuckers. Four minutes into this, I get mad. I get real mad about this shit. Um, now, let's go back to the FBI part. Look at all of these links. They, and they, 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 <clears throat> well, it's untrue. <laughs> really? Because if you do a simple search, um, if you do a simple search, you can like a 
find people uh, getting caught. Like this guy. Like the video I made already. At gunpoint. He got caught, stopped at gunpoint. This guy's confronting an officer talking about why are these all of the fires being this guy right here held at gunpoint. That's right. Hmm, let's see, FBI. Oh, what's this? A guy crawling through the fires. And then they showed they had a screenshot of a guy in that in that same scene with a gas tank in his hand. Oh, he's showing it right now. Right there. Oh. Where's the There we go. This is one of my favorite videos. This guy's got him on the she's got him on the ground with a gun. Fuck yeah, dude. Like, you better not move or I'll fucking shoot you. And he's got matches. That's a book of matches right there. Literally just down a fucking a rural... Oh, look at these guys. No. Leftists aren't, aren't out there acting like firemen. Why would they do that? They don't look like they're trying to be firemen lookalikes. Gas cans, axes. Oh, you guys look like good people, though. That's for sure. Maybe you're helping people, right? Yeah, you're helping, you're trying to help, you know, save people, maybe. This idiot fucking posts this on, this is the weirdest one of all. Now, why would you do that? I I, I think my theory is that um, he used, either used a specific card, or maybe his own, like a dumb shit, but that, that he used social media to prove it to the handlers, and it's on 9-11, guys, and it's at, at and it's like at high noon, um, thirty two. Hold on, let's see any significant numbers. Oh yeah, hey dude, hey numbers play on this one, on, on in this stuff. Trust me. Um, three and a half pound single bit axe, an axe, a shovel, an axe and a fucking shovel and a gas can. I mean, in a, a, a five-gallon pour and press kerosene can. Um, what else? Ten. Uh, I don't know. Five pounds. Thanks. Thirty-two ninety-nine. What is this? Fucking like a hundred bucks or something. What was that? Huh. Anyway, a clean-out shovel. Anyway, no. No, they're not starting fires, Mr. FBI. That would be crazy. And 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 local authorities, local police are, are in on it. It is circumstantial evidence. That's exactly what it is. Time. Look at this. They're, they went all out on this shit. FBI.gov. They okay. Look, Washington Post about Joe about the Joe Rogan one debunks rumors. <laughs> really? Because I just debunked it. I just I just debunked the FBI's rumors. Interesting. And I'm like nobody. The Oregonian is the biggest for setting fires in Douglas County Avenue. The Douglas County Sheriff's Office posted a message refuting the rumor on Thursday morning. <laughs> really? Oh, okay. Rumors spread. So I don't know what's going on with the Oregonian. They act like they're they act like they're doing something for for uh, the truth, but then you know what I mean. It's like I don't know, man. You should you should see the shit I've been seeing. They don't. The, Reports a 44 year old man from Mapleton was arrested on September 1st on arson charges in connection to the Sweet Creek Fire. Oh, yeah, that was that's true right there. So, what are these guys trying to say? Like, what do you mean? There is no rumors, it's not rumors. Like, these people are literally busted. They're litter. 
Oh, no. 